Ladies and gentlemen, you are about to witness some scenes from the next attraction to play this theater. This picture, truly one of the most unusual ever filmed, contains scenes which under no circumstances should be viewed by anyone with a heart condition or anyone who is easily upset. Damnation Alley. Everything man remembers is gone. Everything he has achieved is forgotten. Every place he has lived has become a wasteland, desolate, barren. Produced in the magic of Sound 360. More than a motion picture, an adventure you'll never forget. The terror of corruption. No woman will dare go home alone after seeing corruption. Therefore, no woman will be admitted alone to this super shocker. Columbia Pictures presents Heavy Metal. A trip beyond the future to a universe you've never seen before. A universe of magic. Heavy Metal. Swedish Fly Girls know what to do for a man, or to a man. Swedish Fly Girls do what every woman secretly wants to do. Every man should meet a Swedish stewardess at least once in his lifetime. Swedish Fly Girls, rated R. Jack and Jill went up the hill to hack and kill. What became of Jack and Jill? There will come a time on the planet Earth when science and technology will be long forgotten, when humanity will rise from the ashes of nuclear holocaust, when wizards will rule the world. Wizards, the ultimate futuristic fantasy epic. You must keep reminding yourself, it's just a movie. It's just a movie. Color, me, blood, red. This is Adam, and this is a story of Adam and evil. This is a film drenched in crimson, a blood-spattered study in the macabre. Color me, blood red. They took his arm, they took his family, and his soul. His anger is building, and it's going to explode. Now, from Paul Schrader, the author of Taxi Driver, comes a new and shattering film about a man poised on the brink of violence. Ruling thunder. If you love me, if you love me, Eddie, get fired! Eddie! Altered states. When you die in Potter's Bluff, expect the unexpected. Dead and buried. It will take your breath away. All of it. <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger is coming your way on a comet from out of the sky. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Magnificent as Hercules. This is Howard Scott on the scene for TV 12. We're at the Bijou Theater where it's been reported that a man has gone berserk while watching a double feature horror program. A double explosion of bloody terror, blood spattered bride, and I dismember mama. Mothra, whose revenge is more devastating than any man-made weapon. Mothra, indestructible, all-powerful, indescribable. What kind of creature is this god monster, Mothra? Join us for our journey into living hell.
frozen fury preserved in suspended animation. It comes silently screaming through the ages. This terrifying half-human monster awakens at last. Awakens now to vent its murderous wrath on you. <laughs> First time in cinema history, the greatest fear of all mankind will be graphically exposed. Now, a motion picture dares to take you beyond the threshold of the living, where you may discover your own face of death. Faces of death. Now, a major motion picture. Gluttonous Ethel, whose love of food in enormous amounts was equaled only by her immense joy in killing. Do you think I'm going to let you starve me? What's this blood all over the floor? It's not a comedy. It's real. It's unreal. It's heavy. Heavy traffic. My name is Martin. I'm 84 years old. People think I'm crazy when I tell them how old I am. I'd like to be normal. I just have a sickness. The only way I can survive is by drinking blood. From the director of Night of the Living Dead. It's wild, 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 wild for kicks, a motion picture that will leave you breathless. Huh? <gasps> 
Now, Carlo Putti, who brought you Dr. Zhivago, takes you on a journey into the bizarre, terrifying world of the psychosexual mind. Torso. It saturates the screen with terror. Bring your coochie coo to the carnival. The carnival of blood. Do you dare to come alone? Be prepared to live the most wonderful experience of your life. El Topo is not a religious film. It contains all religions. El Topo is bloody. It's funny. It is sexual. El Topo is miraculous and terrible. It is an experience for all of your life. Bring me the head of Alfredo Garcia. This man will become an animal. This woman's dreams of love will be destroyed. Sam Peckinpah, director of the greatest adventure films of our time, has made possibly his most powerful and startling motion picture. Shoot him, kid! Shoot him, kid! Shoot him! He ain't shooting nobody. He's scared! The real Billy the Kid wasn't big or tough or brave. He was a punk. Where's the money? Beyond the Valley of the Dolls is not a sequel. There's never been anything like it before. If you've been waiting for something new, waiting for a film to shake you into the freaked out, mind-blowing scene of right now, then come and see it, man, and find out why it's called Beyond the Valley of the Dolls from 20th Century Fox. Stop it! I spit on your grave. This woman will soon cut, chop, break, and burn five men beyond recognition. Warning. We interrupt this presentation with the following urgent message regarding the stuff. If you see it in stores, call the police. If you have it in your home, don't touch it. Get out. It is addictive and destructive. It can overcome your mind and take over your body. The stuff. You have been warned. Fantastic Planet. Spellbinding science fiction. This audience is watching what the film critic for After Dark magazine has called the most terrifying movie I have ever seen. Every babysitter's nightmare becomes real when a stranger calls Rated R. This is Jack Curtis, director of the film The Flesh Eaters. If you can't stand the sight of flesh being stripped from a human body, please leave the room. There will be a 10 second countdown. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. These things want flesh, any kind of flesh. And once they sense it, they lead their way to anything that comes between them and their meat. Zachariah, the first electric western. It's funny. One night you go to bed, and when you wake up, everything is different. It will turn you inside out. Those people of any age who are upset or affected by scalpel slashing, arm twisting, axe hacking motorcycle maniacs now close their eyes for the remainder of this coming attraction. Did you ever think when the hearse rolls by that someday you are going to die? 
What kind of work do you do? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> you tell me. Easy Rider. It's the story of a man who went looking for America and couldn't find it anywhere. You know, this used to be a hell of a good country. It turned out to be low. Soon, she's going to be a mother. And there might not be anyone left alive to witness the event. In Seminoid, a far from human birth. What is the secret Dwayne is hiding in the basket? What's in the basket, Easter eggs? Open it, if you dare. <laughs> Case. In what Playboy magazine calls the most gruesome epic ever unleashed. Oh, Rick! Oh! Ah! Andy Warhol's Frankenstein, the goriest, sexiest, and wildest Frankenstein ever filmed. It is the gassiest, grooviest, swingingest, trippiest movie you've ever seen. It's uh, not odorless, colorless, and tasteless. As a matter of fact, it's Technicolor. Frankie Avalon and G. Fred Clark, a tower guard. I laugh my head off. So if you see a man walking around without his head, that's me. Welcome to Slime City, home to the derelicts of society. I need some money. And land of murdering, melting monsters. Take a trip to Slime City for the most gruesome and disgusting climax you will ever see. From beyond the dead, from beneath the living, from the depths of hell's ocean, everything they touch will die in the deep. Shock waves. You have crossed every barrier to reality. You are beyond its limits. And you'll never see it again. They're coming to get you. 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 Are you prepared for the motion picture that proves they're coming to get you from Independent International?